<laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> okay. All right, okay, go ahead and crank it. Okay, We're going to see if we can get some fuel coming out of here. We got everything plugged up. Yep. He's plugging up the hole where the fuel injector went. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, that other one's not seating. Yeah, that one's not. All right. All right, it's building pressure now. Good. This one right here is not shooting at all. Okay. Uh, m most of them are shooting very little. Uh, yeah, that one's not seating. So it's, somebody didn't get it in there right. Uh, how, how much should they be spraying? A lot. A lot more than that? Oh, yeah. So you think that's, that's contributing to oh, yes. the problem? Yeah. Uh, and like I said, this one's blocked completely or not working. Uh, leaning, that one was probably not working. Uh, it should fire and run, but uh -huh. that's definitely contributing. I think that's the other problem. The fuel pressure regulator. Yep. I think that contributed because it's pumping too much uh, gasoline into you the EGR valve. Yeah, coming out that's through right. where the fumes should be going. Yeah. The fumes are being redirected to the intake, but you don't, you have liquid going to the yeah. intake. Double, yeah. double liquid. And I'm not I'm not 100 percent sure that like I said that uh, I we were getting fire with that, mm -hmm. but if it was run backwards for so long, yep. it could be weak fire. Uh -huh. So you've got several different uh, variations of what shouldn't be happening or happening mm -hmm. to lead to one big problem, and it's not running. Mm -hmm. Yep. You got weak fire. You got gas going places it shouldn't be. Is is that uh, how old is that coil? You think uh, it's been on there a while, probably. Oh, yes. Yeah. It's. Uh, how, how did you determine it had weak fire? Uh, what I did was, uh, when I first looked at it, it was sitting there like that, and I noticed that they had the firing order wrong. Uh -huh. uh, firing order is, uh, if the coil goes in like this, it's one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. They actually had the coil in the car like this, and they mm -hmm. had the firing order right on the way it should be, one, two, three, four, five, and six, but with them having it backwards, it should have been one, two, three, four, five, and six. Yeah, I gotcha. Instead, it was doing something like what, six, five, four. Yes. Yeah, it was. It was all jacked up. As a matter of fact, to figure out exactly what they did, I had to number all the spark plugs. I took a picture of it, turned it around like it's supposed to be, looked at the firing order while it was still plugged up, and I had them all numbered. I was like, oh man, they got them all jacked up. Oh they yeah. Was, I was like, wow. Wow, so, man. <laughs> I got gotcha. you. Yeah, this is a motorcraft, and it may be original. Uh, Probably it, it, not. May, it may it might be it I'm, might be. I'm surprised it's still firing actually yeah, i am too uh, i've always heard that if you run them backwards it doesn't hurt them mm -hmm. but i've never actually seen anybody turn one around and be able to use it really never gotcha uh, oh, so it may, have, it may have done something to it you think yes hey? i think so yeah <clears throat> so there's a reason why we have all this carbon the oh, fuel yes. wasn't there's no fuel coming through basically yeah, there's no fuel i mean it, just from right here look see that shiny mm -hmm. just from the fuel that got sprayed in there look how shiny oh yeah it's oh, just washing yeah. it away yeah, if you had any yes. fuel coming yeah. in there at all yeah it's going to yeah. clean them up and yeah there hadn't been any fuel see in that wow. see how clean that is yeah. yes. fuel can eat a lot of stuff away oh, yeah yeah so they were not getting yep and i'd say that's your main contributor yep uh, it's letting all your fuel bypass. It probably wasn't getting enough, holding enough pressure, mm -hmm. getting here to pump to these. So yep. that was your main contributor. Yep. And then these being stopped up and uh, low spark. So it's kind of like, it's coming through here. You're not getting enough pressure. And then the second time around, it's like, okay, now we're really going to take you out. Yeah. You know, so yep. you, basically it wasn't getting fuel to the cylinders. That's exactly right. Pretty it much. was getting fuel all the way up and you could smell it when you started it because mm -hmm. it was coming out here back here into the EGR valve. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, you could smell the gas yep. and it was confusing. Like, hey, why am I getting gas? It, it makes sense why you're smelling it so easily. Yeah. <laughs> and does, yeah, that, ex I mean, does the, that explain uh, why the, the fuel is getting in the oil, though? Like, would that yes. make sense then? Yeah, okay. because okay, here's good. what happens. Once uh -huh. it, okay, yeah. so it, it comes through to the EGR valve. This goes yeah. back down into the block, which goes straight down into your uh, right. pistons, rings, all that. So yes. all your gas that was getting into the EGR valve is going yeah. right down into your block. Okay. Where the oil is supposed to Where be. Where the oil is supposed to be. Yeah. Uh, I gotcha. Yep. But that, uh, so the EGR is uh, essentially, uh, well, the EGR reroutes it to the intake, right? Yes. Reroutes, uh, ex it's an exhaust gas recirculation, yes. reroutes it. Is that the crankcase vapors? Yes. That's for, for an American car. That's exactly right. Okay, okay. So that's where your PCV comes in, your yep. PCV. Yeah, which this no longer has. Oh, that's, okay. That's what that is. I gotcha. All right, so it looks like we're... We kind of worked it out, I guess, right? Oh, yeah. Now it's just a matter of <laughs> yeah. getting it all back together. I, I don't think that you 
would have found out without ripping oh, no. it apart. No, there's no way. I think there's no way you can It would have been a shot in a million for yeah. me to take that off and replace it, yeah. which yes. I did. Yeah. Uh, and it's just bad from the... I, I didn't know they had a fuel pressure regulator on the, re- on the fuel row. I had no idea. Yeah. I so, see that I mean, every so often. Yeah. So, I mean, <clears throat> knowing that it's bad, you get them from the factory that way. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How many times do you go to O'Reilly's and get a thermostat? That it's been sitting there for two years. Yeah. And you put it in your car and yeah. it's stuck closed, yeah. it's stuck open, and you're like, What? Yeah. I just fixed that. Yeah. We, guess what? You we got just got we just got a fuel pressure regulator for a grand dam thirty four hundred. Uh-huh. Put it in there in there right new out of the box, it was leaking. Oh, so we had to great. take it off, take it back, yeah. and put another one in there, no problems at all. That was yeah. O'Reilly's part. What do I owe you for reprogramming uh, reprogramming that key? Oh, uh, you know nothing. nothing, man. I hope the key still works. <laughs> oh. well, yeah. I mean. It should still work because it said it was operation successful. Yeah. Oh, if it yeah. doesn't work, it won't. It won't tell you jack. Yeah. You know. Yeah. yeah. But the key, I think, was okay to begin with because oh, yeah. you said you checked the security system. Oh, I did. You know. Yeah. Mm. But. Uh, and like I said, I know the security works because I mean. <laughs> Are you sure? Oh, oh yeah. the keys. Oh, that's that. not. <laughs> you gotta mess with it a little bit. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta wake it up. Yep. I think that's your issue, man. Mm. But you're gonna have to buy some new, like, plastic pieces. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's no problem. And, yeah, uh, and over here for this, for your throttle. Oh, yeah, that's you know, no problem. Do they sell these? Yes. Yeah, they sure okay. do. As a matter of fact, I'll probably, yeah, I've got a motor up there this. Uh, that this will go right back into. Uh, I've probably got several different motors up there that I can. They can get it, okay. Yeah. Do you want us to roll the window back up and then we'll unhook this? Yeah. yeah okay, roll great. the window back up. I'll shut okay. Yep. Okay, sounds good. I gotta clean all it's that a wrap. I'm just gonna shut this.